She saved her house with cakes. And now Angela Logan is starting a business with those cakes. The New Jersey mom originally started baking apple cakes last year to raise some money to keep her house in foreclosure. And she managed to do it. Angela's here in studio right now with one of those fabulous apple cakes. Good morning to you. Good morning. And congratulations on your can-do spirit and taking what your grandmother taught you as a child, how to bake, and turning it into something so profitable. How'd you do it? Well, um, I, you say necessity was uh, what created this invention, you might mm -hmm. say. Um, I uh, had to bake 100 cakes in 10 days. I set a goal to do that. Mm -hmm. And um, when my house was going into foreclosure, and... Um, People came and friends started buying the cake, and then the story went international, and hundreds and hundreds and thousands of cakes and were sold. So, your Teaneck, New Jersey home, it's you're out of foreclosure. Out of foreclosure, the, the house still, you know, we still have to do things to the house, sure. but um, the house is out of foreclosure. I'm baking out of Zoe's Cupcake Cafe and selling cakes online at bakemeawish.com, and I'm also helping, uh, uh, giving 5% to uh, help other people with their mortgage. Um, I'm also speaking, you know, for uh, Green Pass which is an organization that helps people with debt solution and mortgage uh, uh, problems. It, it is an extraordinary thing that you have accomplished because you've taken a terrible situation and not only saved yourself, giving back to others, but you're like the, the classic American entrepreneurial spirit now. You've turned things around. You've got a thriving business. Uh, yeah, it's, a, it's, it's, it's happening. Uh, people are loving the cakes, which well, I'm very happy about. And they love them, and these, these are kind of healthy. I mean, you've talked about taking grandmother's recipe and turning it organic, right? Yes. Um, you know, uh, you getting rid of the white flour, mm -hmm. using white whole wheat, and uh, organic confection, and, you know, some other healthy... Fresh apples all the time. I use fresh apples in all of my cakes. Is that, that's the big secret then? Yes. To help, okay. Fresh, and, fresh, and fresh. And so your friends started buying it, and then what was it you think that really got the word out? It, I mean, just, what, is it just so darn good tasting? Well, or was it your friends trying to support <laughs> you, or both? Well, it was both. Uh, my friends were trying to support me, and then when they found out that the cake was really good, they told their friends, and uh, some people were buying six cakes at a time, some mm -hmm. people were buying two. It, uh, it just, it took off. Uh, I'm curious, you know, I know you're an actress as well. You've done mm -hmm. some commercials. You've been on NBC's Law & Order SUV. I mean, look at that beautiful face. Why not? But did you find yourself thinking, I, I can't believe this is my reality. This is, I've got to be acting in something here when you first found yourself in such financial dire straits. Uh, well, you know, the business goes up and down, but it had never went down the way it did. And there were some unfortunate circumstances where money was taken from me and uh, mm -hmm. an agency closed. And uh, we had a horrible... Um, construction fiasco so as a result of that this you know just the cards just fell in the wrong direction in that at that particular time so um, it was a very frightening time um, and I had to do something and I thought I've got a, this cake is a cake that I took to parties and everybody loved Lynn it. Everyone loved it. And my kids and would eat the entire thing in one day. Well, let me tell you something. Looking at it, I'm thinking this studio is probably thinking the same thing right now. <laughs> $39.95, bakemeawish.com. And thank you so much for joining us. Congratulations, Angela. Thank I love you. your story. Thank you very Good much. Good luck.